What's up guys? Today I want to talk to you guys about how many calories you should be eating every day. So it's important to track your calories, whether you're trying to build muscle, maintain your weight, or lose weight, lose fat. Um, but how do you know how many calories you should be eating per day? There's a couple ways that you can, a couple ways. There are, there are a few ways that you can calculate it. The first, the simplest way that I've found is multiply your current body weight by 15. That'll be your like your maintenance calorie level. So that if you eat that many calories, you'll you'll maintain your weight. So for example, if you're uh, 200 pounds, you multiply that by 15. That gives 3,000 calories. If you eat 3,000 calories, then this is a um, assuming that you're doing at least an hour of exercise every day. So whether it's strength training or walking or some kind of uh, activity, an hour per day. You multiply your body weight by 15 and that'll be your maintenance level of calories. That's like the simplest way to calculate it. Um, there are also a little bit more, uh, if you want to go online, check, like look up TDEE calculators, which is stands for total daily energy expenditure. So basically what that cal it uses like your, your height, your weight, your activity level, uh, your sex, your age to kind of determine exactly how many calories that you burn every day, depending on your lifestyle and uh, your body composition. Lastly, is, this is the method that I've been using, is I have a Fitbit, so it calculates how many calories I burn every day, and I just use that to determine how much I'm eating every day. So if I'm trying to put on weight or whether I'm trying to lose weight, I'll just add or remove calories from the total uh, that I get. I usually, so it fluctuates a lot every week, so what I do is I just do an average of the week and then I split that into uh, what, what my daily calorie in, in, intake should be because there are some days where I'm going to burn 4,000 calories and sure that like that could mean that I can um, increase my, my calorie intake for that day but I find that if I'm trying to it, it's tough to for me at least to like change my diet every day it's better to just eat something consistent and just to adjust the amounts at the end of the week, depending on how much I, how much under I am with my calorie intake and how much uh, with how much activity I've done. <clears throat> so those are the three methods that I, uh, that I suggest that you guys use to find out how many calories you should be consuming every day. So whether it's uh, just multiplying your body weight by fifteen, assuming you're doing an hour of exercise every day, and you should be doing at least an hour of exercise a day. Um, going looking up. TDEE calculator, total daily energy expenditure calculator, which is a very accurate way of doing it. And then third is just to get like a smartwatch or uh, something like that to, uh, to determine exactly how many calories you're burning on a more like personalized level. Obviously some watches are not super accurate. I feel like Fitbit is a reputable enough company that, you know, I think your Apple watch, there's a bunch of smartwatches out there that would be probably pretty accurate, like Garmin's or stuff like that. Obviously, the more money you spend, the more accurate it'll be. You can probably get some. This is, uh, I'll put a link to uh, what this one is. It's like the Fitbit HR. It's like the, the simplest one. And uh, yeah, the battery lasts about 10 days. It cost me about 50 bucks, I think, or 80 bucks, maybe max. And yeah, I, I like it. I enjoy it. It's, uh, so far, it's it's been good for me. So. I do recommend that you know exactly how many calories you should be eating, especially if you're if you have a goal to lose weight or to gain weight, whatever it may be, you have to know the numbers. So that'll be all. And next video I'll talk about like whether you should get on a cut or a bulk or you know how to use that information. But uh, till then, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.